basically involuntary manslaughter does not need to show intent. They are not saying he intended to kill her. It's whether or not he was reasonable. Did he show kind of due care as a reasonable person would in that situation? So essentially what he would have to show at trial is that he was in fact reasonable. He has said in interviews that he did not pull the trigger. That is most likely going to be an argument he would put on trial if he does indeed go to trial. But evidence has shown, and according to investigators, that the trigger was pulled. And that would be a strong point for the prosecution in showing that he was unreasonable in pulling a, uh, you know, shoot, uh, pulling a trigger um, with a gun, even if he thought it wasn't live at a person. That was unreasonable. That will be their argument.